Good, Good morning, morning Wolverines. Wolverines. Today is Tuesday, January 30th, and it is a B-Day. Remember that Friday will also be a B-Day. The Wolverines varsity and JV basketball teams will be playing at home tonight versus Harper. JV games will start at 4.30 p.m., followed by varsity at 6. Enjoy the show. Good morning, West. Gio, Gio and Rosie, Rosie coming, coming at you with, with some brand new insight. insight. Do you like riding? Are you involved with West Riders or want to be more involved? Well, do we have the perfect opportunity for you? Apply for the open mic. Applications for the second ever West Riders open mic night are now available. Dates are pending, so please contact E. Spicer, Z. Jostad, or P. Madsen at benvoke12.org or check student announcements for details on applications. Keep, Keep on, on riding, riding West. West. Hey Wolverines! Today Just Serve is excited to announce our upcoming Sock It To Em Drive. That's right, it's time to gather up those clean, unused socks and get ready to make a splash at the West vs. Bentonville Basketball Halftime Show. Bring your socks to school from January 28th to February 6th, and during halftime at the game on February 6th, we'll be tossing them onto the court. Did you know that socks are actually one of the most needed donations, but they're often overlooked? Let's change that. Each pair of socks you donate will go directly to someone in need. The more socks, the better. Let's show our community that the Wolverines know how to sock it to them. If you can't make it to the game, then collect the socks and bring them to the front office. So mark your calendars and start collecting those socks, Wolverines. We'll see you at the game ready to make a difference one sock at a time. Last weekend, the BWHS Forensics and Debate Team competed at the Cabot Classic. We would like to congratulate the following students. Sophomore Amia Nambiar placed third in dramatic interpretation. She secured her first bid to the University of Kentucky TOC. Freshman Beatrix Drewer and Reagan Hall placed first in duo answer. They secured their second bid to the University of T Kentucky TOC. Freshman Beatrix Drewer and Reagan Hall placed first in duet improv. Freshman Beatrix Drewer placed fifth in humorous interpretation. Freshman Reagan Hall placed fifth in poetry. This is her second bid to the University of Kentucky TLC. Junior Ava Sophia Palacios placed third in storytelling. Freshman Addie Ferguson and Hudson Smith placed seventh in duo interpretation. Freshman Aditi Sashi Dahara placed third overall in novice Lincoln Douglas speakers. Senior Jamal Woodard placed second overall in varsity Lincoln Douglas speakers. Congratulations, Wolverines. Hello, writers. The Yop Literary Magazine is hosting our last writing contest from January to February 16th. With this being said, the theme for our last contest of the 23-24 school year is to write about something you're passionate about. We are looking for things written in a more creative nonfiction sort. We are also hosting our cover art contest. There are no limitations to this contest, so submit whatever you're proud of. This contest will go through January and close on February 16th. Prizes will be granted to the first, second, and third place winners. The first prize winner will receive a guaranteed free copy of Volume 5 and a bonus gift. You can submit by sending your piece to this email or scanning this QR code. You are welcome to submit your writing regardless of whether it is or is not for the contest. As a reminder, the submission window will close when these contests end on February 16th. Keep on writing, West. Hi, I'm Gracie Johnson, director of our State Showcasing One Act. You get the chance to come see it next week, February 1st through the 3rd, 7 o'clock, 7 o'clock, and then 2 and 7 on Saturday. Seating is limited, so buy your tickets now. But first, let's talk about the play. It is Don't Say Macbeth. I want you to know, if you have theater friends, you may have heard... The Scottish play. The Scottish tragedy. The Scottish business. The Scottish myths. The unmentionable. The unspeakable. The unperformable. Or just say that play, everyone know you mean Macbeth. <laughs> Sorry. Awesome. So here's the thing. This is true theater lore. If you're interested, come see it. It's in the black box, limited seating. Buy your tickets today. Please stand and join me for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. At this time, we will observe our state-mandated moment of silence. The silence period begins now.
Hope Tuesday's good to you, Wolverines. And build someone up today.